I haven't seen you in a long time Almost been a year since you broke my heart And tore me apart Oh, yeah y'all can hear us we are chilling at the beach is this the beach on the water it's, beach. it's very windy we decided to just come and chill and listen to the waves and talk so um i was like let's pick up the camera maybe we can talk to y'all for a sec y'all haven't seen mr allen since his work vlog so, I had to pull his arm to get him to come talk to y'all. One much pulling to be involved. <laughs> he was already in the car. Oh yeah, he's already in the car. He's already in the car. Yeah. We came and got us something to eat, a bite to eat. As you can see, it was delicious. I have proof of it. Always gotta have proof. <laughs> proof is because she won't listen to me. He wants me to get a bill, basically. You gotta get no bill. Just take a napkin, place it on your chest, cover all that. Well, I know I'm gonna put my napkin in my lap, but I need to start wearing a bill. It never fails, man. But yeah, it feels so good out here. So, so good. Hopefully y'all had a great weekend. We had a good weekend, but it was busy. But it was good. So this is kind of our like wind down time. This we decided to do to kind of wind down, chillax a little bit. Enjoy the weather. Enjoy this beautiful weather, even though it is cloudy and overcast, but to me, that's the best weather. It's not so hot. Yeah, right. You don't have to worry about the um, heat baking you. The sun. So, yeah. Good stuff. Good stuff. What did y'all do to wind down for the weekend? And what did y'all do for the weekend? We worked. I did some housework. He did some outside the housework. <laughs> and um got a chance to hang out with you meet with music artists this weekend oh yeah he had the, he had the fun work i wish i could have went 
Well, or maybe not, because it was kind of hot. He right. worked a festival this weekend. Mm -hmm. But all good times, good stuff. No complaints. You got any complaints? No yeah, whatsoever. No complaints. Mm. What you want to talk to the people about, babe? I'm just enjoying the view. Enjoying the view. And you want to let the people go so they can enjoy the view? Mm. I mean, we can talk to the people. You gotta interact with the people. What y'all want to talk about? What y'all want to talk about? Like we live or something. <laughs> now that's what I need to talk about. Uh, him right here. He didn't keep his word. He told y'all he was gonna do another live. Don't worry, we got a live coming. What soon. What was that? Six months ago. We got a live coming soon. This is gonna be a good live. Just to let you guys interact with us. We interact with you guys. And really kind of put, uh, really just kind of touch on some topics, mm. uh, different subjects. Oh, okay. You know. Um, I ain't know nothing about this, y'all. It's new to me, too. It's not new to her. She's the one that came up with the idea of touching on different subjects and different suggestions. Oh, I guess I forgot. Right. She just slipped her mind, you know, with a busy schedule and all. Trying to be funny, huh? Well, yeah. Y'all heard of him. He said he's going to do another live. We'll see. We shall see. You know me, I always like to take this time to thank all of our, all of our supporters. Uh, all of our, uh, who gives us great suggestions and uh, great advice. Even some of the ones who give us, uh, I guess they would call it constructive criticism at times. And even for the ones who, who don't like certain things we do, we thank y'all too, because guess what? Y'all still support because y'all watch. So thank you. Okay, credits, okay, okay. You know, you still, you have to, you have to, you know, get the credit where the credit is due. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I read, I read all the comments. I may can't get to all of them as far as commenting. For example, this weekend, like I went three, four days without even looking back at the um, comments because I had a really busy work week. Like, woo, I was so happy for the weekend. So I didn't get a chance to go back and comment like I would normally try to do. So, um, it was some, it was some, what would I call those comments? Some very opinionated people on there this weekend. <laughs> But um, I don't mind. Hey, everybody got an opinion. Don't bother me at all. You have an opinion, I have one. If I feel like it, I'll respond. If not, I'll just, you know, brush it off. But me, on the other hand. He got time. Sometimes I have time. But he always has time. You know, it's not really to be a person to be combative with with anybody. Because and that's what I don't like. I don't day. like all the confrontation. I ain't got time. Yeah, at the, at the end of the day, I really don't like uh, conflict or confrontation. I'm you know, to keep it positive. I love the positive energy, positive atmosphere. That's what I like. Let's keep it positive. Take that negative stuff somewhere else. Right. It's enough going on negative in the world. The world definitely have enough going on as it is. For us to dwell on a negative YouTube comment. And then also to speak on it from a culture from a culture standpoint. We have enough going on uh, in our culture uh, to, to the point that we shouldn't want to tear each other down. You ought to want to build uh, and really but then again, that has nothing to do with culture. You should just want to build your fellow man up um, because of all the negativity that's going on. But I get it. Some people thrive on that. So, you know, some people get a kick out of it. Me personally, I don't. I exercise my rights to block all the negativity. Amen, mister. There's a lot of birds out here. Look, look, I don't know where all y'all, where everybody lives. And I'm sure it's anywhere probably near the water. As y'all can hear, our guests, um, 
beaches. We have a lot of them. And no matter what, especially they love the beach, you may get some that try to get a little video time in. See, look at that, they're flying around behind us. But, uh, look, man, these birds come from everywhere. Because somebody, somebody's feeding them over there. That's what that is. But, yeah. but isn't it amazing how, I said that to say this, it's amazing how these birds don't know one another, but yet they come together for the same cause, and that's to eat. Eat together, break bread together. Yeah, every now and then they have a little bickering, a little misunderstanding about who's gonna get the bread first. But, at, but in all honesty, they don't. They don't care about who got what, or who driving what, or what we can, who can fly the best, or none of that. <laughs> Who's driving? Who can fly the who best? Who can fly the best? They don't care nothing about who can do a loop or none of that. Oh, that's funny. All they want to do is come together and let's get this bread and this food, literally. So I think we should focus more on that. Uh, being helpless to one another, mm -hmm. building each other up, putting some positive back in what's turned out to be such a negative world. Like, like she said, everybody has their comments and they, everybody's opinionated. And we appreciate your comments and your opinions. Some of y'all overdo it. You think so? You think so? Yeah. But it's good because it tells me, a lot of times that tells you a lot about a person. Mm, that's true. You know, it, it gives you, it gives you a lot about their, about their, um, their character. So. I agree. But enough about that. I'm glad to be able to relax. I don't know. Just be working all the dog on time. Take in the, the uh, breeze. The breeze. I wish y'all could feel it. It's, it feels so good. Mm -hmm. And the water has always been one of my uh, one of my safe havens. Me too. Uh, I like hanging by the water. It's where I can get my you know, chance to just kind of wind down the sound of the water allows me to just kind of to wind down and just kind of relax and also, you know, get some thoughts. Get some thoughts in mind. That's a good point I just thought about. Because I, I, it just came to my attention that I was like, man, you know, you just work all the time, right? I jokingly said that. It's true. <laughs> but... I think somebody asked that question before about us balancing work in our relationship. Like, how how do we make that work with our work schedules and with all the things that the hats that we both wear? How do we make that work? And my one answer would be doing what we're doing now. Yeah. We're taking the time. We're setting it aside. And we're spending time with each other. Even though we're talking to y'all, we, we're choosing to talk to y'all for this little time. But <clears throat> we take time and we block out everything else and we focus on each other. I think um, that's what keep our relationship healthy. What do you think, Lou? How do you feel about our balance, work-life balance? I think we do pretty good with balancing out. Uh, like you said, it, 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 it just takes, um, it takes determination, it takes the willpower to say, hey, this, this is what we're going to do, you know, and so that's, that's, now, you know, of course, we don't want to make it seem like it was just been like that from day one. No, and it's you still, know. it's still challenging. It's, it's, it gets challenging. I have to, you know, admit that it's still challenging when you may. I may want to do one thing and we can't because of a schedule or he may want to do something and we can't. Um, it's definitely, it takes a lot of sacrifice. Um, what was that saying? Uh, your, your dad told us you sacrifice now. What's that say? You sacrifice now. Yeah. You, yeah a lot of times you, well, his, his thing was you say no now. Right. And saying no now, you're saying that so it can be on later. Right, right. So I like that. You know, so that stuck was, with uh, us. 
It always has stuck with it stuck with us. It, it won't be like this always. We'll, right. I'm gonna retire. I'm gonna. My plan is to retire early. I'm I'm working hard right now. I'm getting it in, but my plan is to retire early. I'm gonna stick to that. I'm not. I will not work until I'm 65. <laughs> So, and in retiring, I plan on us retiring in Destin. Destin? Yeah. Wait a minute now. I mean, we love Destin. That's my home, but you think? Listen, y'all. Destin is like, to me, it's like my second home. Destin, Florida, that it is. Yeah, Destin, Florida is like my second home. Like, I love Destin. I just love Florida, but Destin for sure. Yeah. It's nice. The people there to me are nice. Uh, everybody's, you know, nice and welcoming. And they are, they are here too as well. Certain, well, we're actually in Mississippi now. I think it's a southern thing. Where um, are we, baby? We're in Biloxi, Mississippi. 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 I'm always trying to be a grammar teacher. Mm. I'm just trying to see what that bird was. I am not, cause I I'm, I have bad grammar myself. Yeah, but I don't never correct you on your grammar. That was just funny. I was like Mississippi, Mississippi. It's about to start raining, y'all. Also, y'all. Also, I had an idea of, um, and I ran across Mrs. Allen. Uh oh. Uh, the next time we travel, when we start back traveling, because we because we get so many requests of us doing like meet and greets and stuff like that. What I want to do is next time we travel to the city, y'all just stay tuned to our uh, Instagram page, and we'll put in the comments or uh, we'll put on put up a post of where we're where we're at. May not necessarily be where we're gonna be, but where we're at. What are we gonna do, babe? And uh, just give the people a chance, to, uh, a lot of people a chance to um, meet up and greet with us. We get a lot of people that meet us. Yeah, we get a lot of people that meet, that we meet like in the grocery stores and stuff like that. And they just, you know, just come up to us. And that's what kind of gave me that idea. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what gave me that idea. That's, uh, that's his idea. I don't know, y'all. Nobody meet and greet. I guess. I guess I want to meet y'all. I guess. These people out here. Oh Lord. Feed these birds. I might be gonna go because they're gonna start pooping. Once they eat, they gotta poop, right? Right. It's literally at least what 50, 50 birds in one area. Of course, it's more than that out here, but just it's about fifty of them congregating oh right now God. in one area. What do they call Se not seagulls, not pigeons? What do they call? Uh, I can't think of the name of them, but y'all know the birds that be at the beaches. <laughs> oh goodness. Anywho, so yeah, we just uh, rambling, chilling at the beach. Miss Allen been playing the whole meet and greet. I don't know when and where and how, but we gonna let him have his moment, his meeting, his meet and greet moment. But um, I think we should probably try to head on back before it start raining, before the weather gets bad and gets dark. So um. We're gonna let y'all go. I guess we'll see y'all uh, next time. Real soon. Real soon. So the question is, when we see you guys on here, or when we see you all in person? Listen, I don't know why he keep telling y'all about this meeting. Greetings. We're gonna we'll do a meeting greet when we can get him on uh, three consistent videos for the week. How about that? That'll be the that'll be the point. When we can get him to do three consistent vlogs, either by himself or with me, we'll do a meeting. Three group. consistent uh, three consistent vlogs. Not a clue with this one either. Three consistent vlogs 
with at least 2,000 views a piece. Well, I know that can happen. That ain't the hard part. The hard <laughs> part is getting you in the video. Three consistent videos. That's going to be the best. Three consistent videos, whether by yourself or with me, in, in a week's time. And then we can do a meet and greet. How about that? So that's on you. That ain't on, on them. That's on you. All right. How many of y'all going to challenge me on that? Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. You, oh, y'all, you never did address what the people said about us giving them a name. There was so many names they gave. I was. I got to go back and look at the comments because there were so many names coming in. I had kind of lost track. And, you know, of course, again, with my work schedule, I just wasn't able to keep up. So I'm going to go back and look at the names. We're going to have to make the decision when we have our next live video. If it's going to be soon. I don't know. He's talking about a month or two. We're going to have a live video real soon. Okay. So we'll give him time to look at the names in the comment section. And you want to choose or you want to let the people choose? Vote on it. You want to choose the name? Yeah, we're choosing the name. Choose, we're, we're, see what got a, still has the best ring to it. Right. Okay. So we'll do that. Okay. So he got a uh, he got a challenge going on. He's gonna be in three consistent videos. <laughs> and he got a live video to do. <laughs> we're gonna have to come up with something for her. This is gonna be funny. Please, yeah, come up with something for me. Okay, y'all. Let's get out of here. It's getting dark. Uh, we enjoy talking to y'all today and we will see y'all in the next video, okay? <laughs> Have an amazing week. Talk to y'all later.